I don't know if I'm a masochist, but I have to go through like incredible pain to feel like I'm worth anything. I don't know why. I'm Gabriel Juan Fernando, and I'm Cheat Death NYC. I've been riding bikes all my life. The first bike that I've ever had was a Huffy. My godmother got it for me when I was like eight years old. I was the first ever bike I rode, but getting paid to ride my bike, that was like when I was coming out of jail and rehab. The only job that I could come across was for this Chinese fusion food restaurant in the city. I would go out and I would do food deliveries on the bike. The bike messenger culture is what made fixed gear like popular. I was like fixated on fixed gear because I would watch like these bike documentaries and then I would get super inspired. I'm like, yo, wow, that's, that's amazing. Like you can just like go in and out of cars and meet different people, like just make art everywhere, you know what I mean? And it was beautiful. The first thing I'm trying to do is ride with no brakes because that's the purpose of having that specific bike. And then I end up getting bored. That was like my first cheated death moment. I started getting popular on social media for getting hit by cars. Like I've had people like really run me over, run me over, you know what I mean? I would say I've been hit like at least 12 times. So I like surpassed my nine life already, right? I've seen the white light and like come out of it like nothing and then buy another expensive bike and then just keep riding. It's just thrilling, it's fun, it's exciting. Like why wouldn't you wanna do that? Be a badass, you know, like go by your rules. The euphoria of the world beneath your feet flying at full speed, just being one with that bicycle. It's just poetry. I decided to get a camera to capture it. Just ripping it up, like not giving a fuck, like just being rebels. My art, it's just how I express myself and like what I go through because I've been like in real dark places, bro. Like some days I feel crazy, you know, like, I don't feel like I can make it. Like I feel like killing myself. It's hard to get out of that mental space and know that it's only temporary. Escaping on my bike, it, it gets me out of that soggy feeling, you know, like it really empowers me to try harder. You have to put in real work to help yourself. This is your life. Remember that this is your life and you only have one shot. You must live your life. I'm blessed say that I'm alive, to understand the amount of joy and um, love you can get from just riding a bicycle. It really changed my life in a drastic way because I want the world to hear me. I want the world to know that I exist and to be totally fucking free.